Yesterday I woke up, I went to the gym, and by the time I was back at home, I realized that the Jaguar XGR9 event finally appeared, so today I will talk about it and how I had to run as fast as I could to lock it through its K-Packs before it was too late. So let's begin with today's video. As many of you may know, the packs of the latest special event cards are usually locked behind a certain amount of conditions that you have to fulfill in order to be able to buy them to start up the special event car or even try your luck with the K-Packs including the K of the special event car as it's the case for this Jaguar x 9 which I already reviewed on this channel fully golden with the help of a pro player and if you are interested you have the video link in the description by the way and as we could see, it's a quite useful A-class car for slipstream and speed-oriented tracks. So, well, the thing is that if there are two special events running at the same time, sometimes the game confuses the amount of conditions that you have on a special event with the condition that you have on the other special event. And that means that despite I hadn't even played the Jaguar x 9 special event, I would have access to the Jaguar packs if I reached 250 conditions on the Lamborghini Revuelto special event. Therefore, that was my chance to lock and start up the Jaguar without even struggling through the special event requirements. But as always, there was a problem. Because of my laziness, I got a 211 conditions on the reworld to special event. Therefore, I had to gather as fast as I could the last conditions required to lock the packs before Gameloft actually fixed the poop, as they usually do every time something like this happens. Usually, they release a fix on a quick patch an hour after the special event starts, so I managed to get the condition exactly 50 minutes after the event start. Then I immediately ran to the store and the packs were finally unlocked. I started to buy them as fast as my hands could click and that's why it's kinda hard to appreciate the pack's content on this video, but after spending 12,000 tokens, the key finally appeared. The Jaguar x 9 was finally mine, but since I was close to get the fourth start of the car, I decided to spend 900 tokens more just to get a few more blueprints. I already calculated that I will manage to four-star it before the special event ends, so it's an absolute win for me, since that was pretty much my main goal regarding this car, as I said in my previous videos. Okay, so now talking a bit about the special event, I have to say that the worst scenario where the surpasso would be required finally happened, so if it wasn't because of this whale bug, I probably wouldn't have unlocked this car, so I have to say that I'm kinda lucky that I managed to get it with 12,000 tokens. The problem now is that I think that the surpasso will be required to unlock the Koenigsegg CCXR, so I think I won't be that lucky with that special event. Also, I saw a few people spending absolutely insane amount of tokens and either not unlocking the Jaguar or maxing it up at a way too high cost. So I guess I had luck with the key packs because the blueprint packs doesn't seem to have a good drops overall. If we focus a bit on the Frank Jimento Sorpasso, it is pretty much like a copy of the Terzo Millennio, but with a way weaker Nitro and despite that obtaining a free car at the Grand Prix is always welcome. I don't have the resources nor the will to max it in order to meet the requirements to lock the Jaguar. And also I don't have all the required cards a fully max set, aside from the Sorpaso, so I wouldn't have stand any chance to lock the Jaguar. The special event decal, I have to admit that looks quite nice, but it's not at my reach to be honest. But now it's your turn. Will you try to go for this Jaguar or you will save as many resources from the event as possible? Will you try to unlock the Surpasso as well? Let me know in the comment section, make sure to subscribe in order to not to miss anything about Asphalt 9 and I will see you really soon with much more Asphalt content. Goodbye guys!